Hi, my love, beautiful souls. It's Mystic Rose of Love and Love. And I'm back with True Bring and Dark into the Light. Please take a look at it and leave it. Does not sleep. She must close the ring now. First ring. Close the ring now. First ring. Are you awake now? Yeah. The lights off, you guys. Um, Church is napping, and so I'm letting her nap. Someone never gives you a straight answer. Okay, someone never gives you a straight answer. It's like, uh huh, uh huh. They can't say yes, no. Okay, what's going on here? What's going on? I'm hearing shift your reality. Okay, it's time to shift your reality. It's time to shift that consciousness to higher consciousness, higher reality. You are a multi dimensional being. Okay, what's going on here? What's going on? Collective. Wow. Okay, a card flew and I don't know where it went. Hmm. Hold on, guys. I know a card went down. What the hell? Okay, if it went, I guess I did. Right there. Oh. Has a long history of doing this. That card I was just looking for you guys, okay? Huh. Has a long history of doing something, okay? Whatever came out here. Huh. It was literally hidden. Something being hidden from you. Um trying new tactics change up what's your what you're doing. Okay? Try new tactics. Change up what you're doing. Somebody needs to change up what they're doing. Okay, do something differently. Somebody has a long history of doing something. The same thing. I said sh shifting your reality. Okay, consciousness. Wow, okay. So that came right. Okay. New timelines. Shifting realities. It's time to shift that reality. Okay, the timeline. Acts like you don't matter, but... But jacking off to you. Okay. They act like you don't matter, but they're jacking off to you. Okay, that's... Wow. Okay. Somebody didn't think that you mattered to them, or they treated you like shit, and, but then they're looking at your pictures and jacking off, thinking about you. This person doesn't really have a heart. They're doing the same thing over and over. They need to change up their ways, okay? Something, but they need to change their ways. Your ears ringing. Let's get one more. What's going on here? I smell weed. My husband's not even home, so I smell it. Don't get on that plane. Wow. Okay, don't get on that plane. Somebody's left handed. Don't get on that plane. Just keep jumping on that plane. Somebody doesn't want you on that plane. Somebody doesn't want you to shift your reality either. Karma caught up to them. Karma caught up to them. Yeah, karma caught up to them. Okay. Okay, what else going on? Haven't seen them in years. You have not seen this person in years. Somebody that you have not seen in years is doing the same thing over and over, okay? They need to change your taxes. They need to shift realities. You may have shifted realities. You may be shifted timelines, okay? And somebody from your past has not, and they're just getting stuck in the same thing over and over. Your rings, your ears have been ringing a lot or tickling a lot, okay? That's you connecting with your higher self and your angels, uh, angels and ancestors, okay? Spirit guides. That's connection with your higher self and consciousness, okay? Somebody doesn't want you being on a plane, um... This also, I'm getting like this, don't get on a plane, is like, you not, like, they did not want you to go high, okay, level up. They wanted you to stay below them, okay, they wanted you to stay with them or below them, and you didn't, you went, you, you got on that plane, like, you took to new heights, okay. 
um, they don't want to get on the plane. Like, they're the ones that don't want to get on. They want to stay in this low vibing energy. Okay, somebody could be left-handed, okay? Karma's catching up to this person that you haven't seen in years, okay? So if you've been wondering what been happening in this person, maybe you cut off that, like, you walked away and you're wondering what's happening to them, karma's catching up to them. Things are happening in their life, okay? Negative things happen in their life. Comes off super sweet. Has done this for a long time. This person came off super sweet. Abuses Coke and Viagra. Resigning due to embarrassment. Spiritual ass whooping. Okay, this one I'm being like, yeah, you re you've been resigned. Okay, you re you've been resigned. Okay. Um, this could be some embarrassment. I'm just hearing you're being resigned. Okay, to be away from this, not be at this. Um, this person that. Has done something wrong, okay? Or why you walked away, betrayed this person, betrayed you. They're receiving a spiritual ass whooping, okay? Because they did you wrong. I'm hearing so many different messages and different things here, okay? Different scenarios, okay? It's okay, like so many different scenarios, so many different messages here. Like, in different, each of these cards. And again, like, I just now went back to don't get on that plane. Somebody do not get on the plane, okay? There's something, something about plane, plane, plane crash, okay? If your intuition is telling you that, don't get on. Not all planes like that, okay? I'm just hearing somebody, you have a gut feeling. Before you're going on that plane, you're traveling, vacation. And you feel like you don't want to get on that plane. Don't get on that plane. Because, like, that's what I'm getting is, like, uh, what's it called? Uh, final destination. Okay, you had a premonition, okay? Gut feeling premonition. Somebody had a premonition not to get the plane because um, something's going to happen, okay? If there's no crash, it may not be a crash. It just means something happened on a plane. Okay, something can also happen on a plane. It's not always crashing, okay? There could be other things that happen on a plane. Um, I missed... I don't know what cards to use now because of this. Let's see. Yeah, somebody's getting a spiritual ass whooping because what they did to you. They can't take back what they've done to you, okay? That's what I just heard. They can't take back what they've done to you. Somebody makes a lot of excuses, okay? They they can't take back what they've done to you because they're, they're receiving this spiritual ass whooping, okay, from your ancestors. They're abusing drugs, okay? Viagra. You could be encountering with extraterrestrials, okay? Higher consciousness, okay? This karma they're, they're receiving, somebody could be ending up in jail, okay? Being handcuffed right now. Miranda rights means that you're going to jail, okay? They're reading your rights to you to go to jail. Anything you say can you be against you, used against you in the court of law, okay? When they, they're reading your rights that you're being arrested. Okay, somebody could be part of a secret society. Have a backup plan. Okay? Have a backup plan. If you feel like you can't get on this plane or something happening, have this backup plan. Okay? Prepare. I'm not scared of planes, you guys. I planes. I love planes. Okay? I love planes. And I feel like getting in a car is more dangerous than getting in an airplane. Okay? So, and I, well, I guess, too, I don't have fear. Okay? That's the thing is, don't have fear. I don't fear. If I die in a plane crash, I die in a plane crash. That's my, what what's meant for me. Okay? What's meant for me, then? Saturn coming out here. We have Capricorn uh, and Aquarius. This is karma. Okay, lessons to be learned. Lessons can be very difficult. Okay, somebody that was brainwashed in the past, okay, that's why they're receiving the spiritual ass whooping too, okay? Um, because they were brainwashing you. You broke free. Okay, you broke free. You may feel like you have eyes all on you. My cards aren't in the normal spot because I was up gone yesterday. Because they don't like you. It's okay not to be liked, okay? It's okay not to be liked. 
Get yourself a double. See, it's time's up. They can't keep messing around. Your ancestors called judgment, okay? Whoever betrayed you, whoever hurt you, it, their time is up. Everyone who went against you is receiving a spiritual ass whooping. Every single human being went against you is receiving a spiritual ass whooping. Okay. In the spiritual realm. And they don't know what's happening to them either, okay? These people don't even know what's happening to them. You're a star seed. Okay, things are happening in their life. They don't even understand what's happening to them. They don't get it, okay? Their life is going to crumble. It's like life is all over the place, okay? Everything that's happening in their life is because they're receiving a spiritual ass weapon. I don't even know how to explain it. It's like what I'm hearing, it's it's hard to explain, like they can't stop feeling guilty too of what they've done to you. Okay? And they're being punished for everything that they've done to you. And so they have to keep living, reliving that over and over and over in their head that what they've done to you. So somebody that betrayed, these people that betrayed you may be living over and over in their head for what they've done to you. And they can't get you out of their head. Like they can't get the situation out of their head. It's like a replay over and over to them. Their life ain't going to get better until they can own up to it, okay? And apologize. And come forward with the truth. They need to make it right. They need to make it right spiritually and physically. This could be a friend. Okay, spiritually, they need to make it right. Okay, they're committing a lot of corruption. You went through the spiritual awakening. They're trying to compulse you. Compulsion. You need to get compulsion. Making you do things that you don't want. See, it's over for them. Okay? Grim Reaper is coming for them. Angel of Death. Okay, they may be seeing supernatural things, okay? Okay, what I'm hearing is their mind can't stop, okay? Their mind can't slow down. Their mind, they don't have any inner peace. They don't have anything like, it's goes 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 like a circus okay that's what i'm like seeing a circus a wheel hamster wheel over and over because what they did to you that's why they're receiving the spiritual what has been in like it doesn't stop okay so it just keeps going and going and going like a or a circus whatever you want to say and it's going like this because they are in denial and they don't want they they don't want to apologize they don't want to own up to their mistakes they don't want to own up to their actions they don't want to own up to what they did to you And they're just going to have to keep living this like this. Their mind. It doesn't stop. And their life is just falling apart. Because they can't let go of their ego. They can't let go of pride. They just don't, they don't want to let go. That they're wrong. This person don't want to let go that they're wrong. Or what they did wrong. Like, to you. Betrayed you. Your psychic abilities are helping others, authority solve cases, okay? I feel like it's a different download. Came out, but you, your psychic abilities can be helping others. This person may be getting federal indicted because of it. Okay, they're a liar. They're siphoning your magic powers and items, so that could be why they're in this uh, spiritual aspen. Because they're um, siphoning from you. And they're hacking collective consciousness, okay? They're trying to hack your consciousness, okay? And others as well. This person, this, these people, not just person, these people have a rude awakening happening for them. Their life is not going to get any better until they own up to what they've done. And I'm here to repent. Ask God for forgiveness. Ask God to help with the situation.
they're ignoring the fact that they hurt you. They're ignoring the fact that they had any portray in doing whatever they were doing to you, okay? Pure denial. Don't think they can do anything wrong. Some, they're not able to get jobs. They're not able to move forward. They're not able to, you know, settle down. Okay, they're, they're not able to have a calm mindset. Go into a meditative mindset. Like, my, like because of this. They're poisonous. Toxic, unhealthy behavior of people. And that's what's happening in their life now, too. Okay, now they're dealing with toxic people. Okay, so what they did to you, now it's happening to them. So now spirit wants them to know, okay, well, this is what you did to the collective. This is what you did to my chosen one. This is what you did to my, um, my soul family. Okay, my child. Like, this is what you did to them. And now I'm sending people. Now you're going to be dealing with toxic people. You're going to be dealing with unhealthy uh, people, behaviors, because you did that to someone. Now you have to feel it, experience it. What you do unto others is what you undo. What you do unto others is comes back onto you. So if you don't want to be betrayed, if you don't want to be lied to, then don't lie to others. Okay? If you don't want to be hurt by somebody, don't hurt someone. If you don't want to steal from somebody, don't steal from them. Or if you don't want someone to steal from you, then don't steal from somebody else. And that same thing is if you don't want somebody to steal from you, do not steal from a store. Okay? So if you steal from a store, say you don't steal from a friend or a family member, but you steal from a store... Somebody's going to still steal from you. Okay? Cause, effect, universal laws. These people are going to be crying. Like, I'm hearing crying, okay? They're going to be crying. They're going to be begging and pleading God to forgive them and help them and assist them. And I'm also hearing they're going to be begging and pleading you, too, with a special spiritual ass whooping, okay? They're going to be begging and pleading, pleading for you to forgive them so they can actually not be insane anymore because this is insane, okay? This is them, like, going crazy, okay? Because what they've done to you, that's why they're going crazy. You plead, an, uh, you plead a lesson, you're done with it. Okay, you're done with it. You're over it. See, they're closed in, trapped, frustrated. Okay, locked up. Okay, mentally locked up. This is closed, trapped. They can't move forward. Okay, they can't even grow or heal or expand because of the fact that's what they did to you. Because you're in denial. You're happy. Or they're in denial. Okay, they're in denial. And you're happy. They're not facing the truth. Okay, what else? Anxiety. Panic. Scared. Yeah, they should be. They should be. They went against a child, um, child of God, okay? A chosen one, anointed one. A star seed, a light bringer. If you're here to be a light bringer and a light worker to heal people and awaken people and to raise the vibration frequency and you go against somebody that's a light worker, you're going to have karma. You're going to have ass whooping. And it's only going to get worse until you can own up to it. So whoever these people are in this, this situation that betrayed you collective, hurt you, their life is only going to get worse until they can actually apologize to you face to face admit what they did wrong and stop doing it too learning from it they need to start learning from this and things are going to continue happening to them like they did to you until they learn they stop we have some kind of settlement agreement compromise Somebody from your past, something in the past history, what's happened in the past. This could be family as well. 
I don't know, like, there's a lot of this energy coming out last day, a couple of days too, it's like, what are you doing collective, if you're healing, growing, people, family members, people, friends, family members, are mad because you are growing and you're not into their business and so worry about them and what they're doing like you're just doing your own thing so now they're being spiteful okay they're being spiteful but you watch away because a lot of these energies are toxic Okay, a lot of these energies are toxic, low vibing, and you just couldn't do it anymore. Like, you couldn't do it anymore. You had to see, you had to try something different. You had to change up, okay? You had to do something different. You couldn't, you couldn't continue with this, in this, you couldn't continue this path, okay? With what's at, like, these people, you couldn't continue. You couldn't continue going on that road. You knew that if you continue down this road, it's not going to get you anywhere, okay? It's just going to continue in pain and suffering like they are, okay? And you don't want to deal with that, with, like, their pain and suffering. Is what I'm hearing. You don't want to deal with that. Yeah, see, there's a breakup. Somebody's a secret trip, remember? Somebody's a secret trip going on. I said, uh, traveling time, okay? Intergalactical inter travel. They're healing. You're going to new heights. You received a spiritual ass whooping too. Okay? I'm hearing you received it too. Okay? Before everything else, before you healed, grow, before this healing and this galactical travel that you had, you had a spiritual ass whooping too. You went through it. There was that whipping your ass as well. Getting you back on track. So it's not like you didn't get this at all. Like, you got it too. Okay, what else? Let me go more messages. Okay, running away. Okay, trying to run away, avoid. We have a child coming out. Okay, bear, social media, and then river. Okay, creek, get balanced by river, down by river. See, they're imprisoned. Okay, mentally imprisoned. And that's why when I'm here, like, cir like a circus and, like, hamster wheel just going around and around, that's a mental prison, okay? Because they know they did wrong, because they came against you, they betrayed you. They attacked the wrong one. They attacked a light worker. Okay, somebody that was here to bring light into people's lives and raise vibration and consciousness. Let's close this out. They're not able to move forward. Okay. See, they're not enlightened. Okay, but you are enlightenment. If I put this upright, you have been enlightened. Okay, you're moving forward. Okay, enlightened. This came out as them. Okay, they're living in the darkness. They're living in pure darkness, but you're enlightened. Moving forward. 23. Choices. 9. Understanding consequences. So when you had your spiritual ass whooping, you knew, like, you had to make things different, okay, or make things right. You had to do things right, okay, you had to, what is it called, um, it's kind of like the NAAA books, like the 12 steps, make amends, that's the word, okay, make amends. So you knew you had to make amends with yourself and people around you, okay, you knew to go apologize to people that you hurt, betrayed, okay, making those amends, okay, uh, 
uh, understand the consequences. You knew that what you'd done was like a uh, cause and effect. Okay, so you you had to deal with that consequence, whatever it was, and you had that spiritual ass weapon. Somebody like these messages, like I know what I'm trying to say today. I want to put them out, but it's like somebody's trying to uh, tongue tie my words, like you know, what I mean, twist my my tongue and like not allow it to come out. So people are confused and stuff. They they don't want the message to come out because it's the truth. Tongue tying. Um, there's too many people that just don't want like there's a lot of people in this world because it's collector reading a lot of people in this world that want their secrets to be hidden okay kept hidden and you're one that speaks truth and it's, I just heard explosive them too And you know that truth always comes to light, okay? It always comes out. It always comes out. Eventually, in time. It always does. It always does. This person can't sleep either. Okay, they can't sleep. Somebody has restless leg syndrome or whatever. Okay, that's a confirmation for somebody with restless leg syndrome. Shaky legs. I don't know. Shaky legs. 18. Okay. Health conditions. Health problems. New opportunities. Keep positive thoughts. Okay. Oh, I know what cards I wanted. See, I knew before I closed out. I knew there were. I was looking for um, Patrice's Purpose. LLC. This reading, and I don't know what's happening. I okay, I was gonna close up, but then I was to do these. Okay, but this is the card I actually wanted for this reading, so that's why when I was doing the cards, I was gonna grab these out before I grab these ones. The spiritual ass whooping. Your past has been forgiven by God. See, you had your spiritual ass whooping and your past has been forgiven by God because you repented. You asked God for forgiveness. And that's what they need to do. Teach others your knowledge. Tell them your past experience at therapist could be a service. Take a spiritual bath to break curses and remove negative vibes that, that have been sent your way. See, that's what you've been doing. You've been taking spiritual baths, spiritual showers and stuff to remove curses that have been... Um, you know, over you, curses have been over you. Um, this will help clear up those negative energies, okay? You guys, I do have in my shop, I have basalt ritual kits, okay? Basalts that will help with spiritual, like, cleansing. Uh, so if you want to check that out, 20% off, which be handling, uh, basalts, okay? They're, you put them in a bath and you just soak up, okay? It calms you, relaxes you, refreshes you, removes negative energy. 20% off, which be handling. I love, oh, that is Pisces, Gemini, Pisces, Leo, and number five. I love you guys. Love, peace, like, heal, namaste.